Hey, Brian from Garage Mall. If you are wondering, these are not real fish. Um, but I'm going to be demonstrating a, a new fish hook remover tool that I picked up on Amazon. And I was actually pretty excited to get these. It was a, it's a two-pack. And so it comes with uh, two fish hook remover tools. And it comes with like these two, uh, two little leashes, which is pretty neat. And... The reason why I got these is uh, I am not an avid fisherman. I got to be honest with you. Um, I do like the sport. However, it's not something that I do very often. However, um, I mean, if you've been fishing a long time, you can definitely get these hooks out yourself. But there are times like if you have a fish that has teeth, um, obviously this one doesn't, but if you have a fish that has teeth or is an aggressive fish or a heavy fish, Sometimes you just need a little bit of help in getting like the fish hook out like this one It's the mimic when you get like a regular hook like on you know on the front lip But sometimes if it gets around a bone or anything else This little guy you can get right in there and grab onto the hook and you pull up and You can work that hook out without getting even close to that guy's mouth. So boom that hook is out Thank you, Mr. Uh, Fake Fish. And here's another one. I mean, this is kind of like I set this up to kind of mimic if they swallowed a hook. So, I mean, you have a long barrel on this that you can kind of get in there. And you are going to be able to get right down into that, that mouth of that fish. And you're going to be able to get that hook out without having to put your fingers in there. I mean, you know the kind. Like, if they swallow that thing and you only see the fish line sitting out there and that hook is really deep in there. This is going to enable you to get down to the throat of that fish really deep and you're going to be able to get the hook out. And uh, if that fish had uh, any type of teeth or one of those like really sandy type uh, jaws, this is definitely going to save your fingers for sure. Anyway, uh, Brian from Crosham Hall, thanks for, uh, thanks for watching and thanks for checking out my, uh, my fish. Be safe out there.